Hey y'all, welcome back to the party. It's me, your girl, Britt Reacts, and today we are reacting to Alanis, Alanis Morissette, ironic. Let's see what she has to say. You wanna do another song? Sure. All right, good. This is Alanis Morissette, it's very, very exciting for me. Do you, are you sick of doing those songs or you, you still like it? I still love it. Different versions too, with different bandmates. Yeah. We've been playing different versions of it over the last. Yeah, these dudes are good. These two guys. It's. Yeah. It looks like it's fun. I. You know. I wish I could do that. Yeah. Well, guess what? You can't. <laughs> oh, shut up. <laughs> We've seen your karaoke and hey, mine. Hey. <laughs> oh no. All right. We'll quiet down. <laughs> hi, hi, hi. Hi, 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 hi. Wow. An old man turned 98. He won the lottery and died the next day. The lottery. I don't even know what the heck that was she just did with her voice, but it was so beautiful. Her voice. <clears throat> well, number one, I mean, I don't think there is another voice out there like this. Not that I am familiar with. But it has such, I mean, it's just, it's so unique, right? Like, I feel like her voice has its own fingerprint, 100%. But like the, that, like the beginning, the huh, huh, like whatever was, hold on. I just got to listen to this again because I'm so taken aback. It's so also like full and, and open and crisp and clear. It doesn't feel muddled or like, I don't know. I'm truly... Okay, I'm, I took it all the way back to the beginning. Wow. An old man turned 98. He won the lottery and died the next day. That's sad. It's a black fly in your Chardonnay. It's a death row pardon, two minutes too late. It's a death row pardon, two minutes too late. The the breaks that she's doing with her voice that have that, like, it's like breaks wrapped in yodels. Come, give me a break. And she does it so easily. Like, she doesn't have to close her eyes or think about it. They just, like, come out. Okay, so she's just coming up, with, she's just talking about all these like unfortunate circumstances, right? You win the lottery the next day, you're gone. You get a, a death row pardon a, a minute too late. Like all these things, I'm not sure if exactly she said a minute or a day. Uh, but it's just like unfortunate circumstances, which irony, right? The irony is you won the lottery and now you're gone. You got pardoned, but you're already gone. Isn't it ironic? Don't you think it's like rain on your wedding day? It's a free ride when you've already paid. It's the good advice that you just didn't take. I love all of the examples. It's like rain on your wedding day. It's like, what else did she say? She's mentioned also a fly in your glass of wine, which I don't find ironic. I just find it makes me irate. <laughs> um. Oh, a free ride. Good advice that you just didn't take. Mr. Play it safe. Mr. Play it safe. Was afraid to fly. He packed his suitcase and kissed his kids goodbye. Yeah. Suitcase. I have never heard a voice like this before. And it really, really feels so like authentic to who she is. I don't know where her career started, but I hope she's always sounded like this. I feel like. It feels like she's always sounded like this. Like this is just who she has always been. Like the cool artsy girl in school that like maybe people didn't like, but like she ended up being the coolest person on the block. Like, <laughs> I don't know. I just feel like she feels so secure and grounded in her vocals, so confident and sure. And she says she sings the songs differently. I don't know if this is 
the way she sings it all the time or she does kind of play with the choices that she makes but I hope she always does this kind of playful um singing with the, with the breaks and the all the fun stuff she's doing I, you it is all down life to take that flight as a plane crash down oh no well isn't this nice and isn't it ironic yeah don't you think it's like rain You just didn't take And who would have thought It figures Well, life is a funny way Of sneaking up on you When you think everything's okay And everything's okay And even then she kind of Jumbled all the words together But it's you. It's so clear I just love how clear her voice is It's quirky But it's clear Like Oh, I don't want this song to end. <laughs> I want everyone to know right now, I don't want it to end. Oh, I love you. Al uh, is it Alanis? I think he said Alanis. I'm going to go with Alanis Morissette. It's so good. Anyway, you're up on you when you think everything's okay. Everything everything's okay. going right. a funny way of helping you out when you think everything's gone wrong and everything blows up in your face a traffic jam when you're already late oh no smoking sign on no smoking. let's hear that again because it was delicious late a no smoking sign Smoking sign. Like, who? Who's out here singing like that? Nobody. I have to hear it one more time because it's so pretty. Already late. No smoking sign on your cigarette break. It's like 10,000 spoons when all you need is a knife. Mm. It's meeting the man of my dreams and meeting his beautiful husband. Uh, oh! <laughs> I love that. See, there's a, some sense of humor in it too because it knife and wife would have rhymed. But she said, and I'm not only does he have a spouse, but it's the opposite sex. So even if he wasn't married, he wouldn't be interested in me, girl. <laughs> Which in a lot of thing, in a lot of ways, irony is that, right? Like it's just so, you have to laugh at it. You're like, are you kidding me? So even if I had a chance, I didn't have a chance. Noted. My dreams and meeting his beautiful husband. And isn't it ironic? Don't you think you a little think. too? How come this woman has not ever been like, has she been the voice of a Disney princess? Like at least the singing voice? Her voice is so magical. I'm so impressed. Like I think more than anything, I'm just like, I'm adoring her. Like I'm, I'm impressed. What a unique commanding voice you have, Mrs. Morset. Well, I think Mara says probably her middle name, but you heard it. I said it. Wow. You move me. Seriously.
seriously. You know, and Howard for me, Howard does a really good job of um, finding the words that sometimes I can't find. Like you move me. He's really, he's a very descriptive person. Um, and that probably comes from years of hosting and, you know, speaking forever and ever. But yeah, that was, she just is special. That voice. And it was so playful and light. She didn't seem like she had to really reach deep down inside for any of it. Like it just sprang out of her like like a gazelle. That one's getting added to my uh, playlist. In case you were wondering. Go and have the day you deserve. Peace.